The first medicines and drugs used by humanity was herbs. Our ancestors had learned over thousands of years what herbs helped us and what herbs didn't, as they found ways to extract and preserve the goodness from these plants. Most cultures have knowledge about the plants growing in their area and how they can be used. Some of this knowledge has been passed down through the generations and some of these natural herbal remedies can be found in our modern drug stores today, although vastly diminished in size to the array of natural herbal remedies that they could include. Alternative medicine should not be considered an opposite to modern day medicine and pharmaceutical drugs since they actually have many things in common and could work more effectively hand in hand. Alternative medicine, natural medicine and holistic medicine are just some of the terminology used to describe herbal medicine, which covers many healing arts, traditions and therapies, all under one big umbrella. And here are a few of them. There are nutritional therapies, which are ways of eating healthily and having a well-balanced diet. There are supplementary therapies, which includes taking vitamins, minerals and compounds to boost the body's system. There are relaxation therapies such as mindfulness, meditation, hypnotherapy and visualization therapy. There is exercising, which includes yoga, tai chi and walking in nature. There are manipulative therapies, including massage, osteopathy and chiropractic care. Herbal medicine is using medicinal plants as an alternative or in combination with pharmaceutical drugs. Aromatherapy is the use of essential oils from medicinal plants to enhance massage and relaxation. Floral therapy is used for therapeutic energies obtained from medicinal plants. Homeopathy is medical doses of healing plant matter there is traditional Chinese medicine, which combines herbal medicine, nutrition and acupuncture. There is Ayurvedic medicine, which comes from India and combines herbal medicine, nutrition, exercise, especially yoga and massage. And there is naturopathy, which combines all therapies and also applies common sense to health.